Jackie? Can I go in there? Of course. Is that a big truck? What do you think? Doing some unloading. What's in there? <laughs> There's a Mama Roo in here. That's usually oh yeah, those are nice. 180. Well, retail for like 180 to 200, depending on the model. Okay. I just sold one for 100 the other day. Yeah. Um, roller derby. I think I see a BB gun. Oh. I need a BB gun for the squirrels. <laughs> Look right there. Right. Yeah. There, BB gun. Can jam. Yeet. What's that? Kids pad. Look at that. All right, this is the one. I don't really have a good reason. I'm just feeling it and I also don't know how much it is, but it's the one. It's gonna be good. I can feel it. Don't hate. Oh, wow. Yeah, draw on our names. We just bought this giant pallet of Amazon returns for $325. Today we're gonna open it up and see what's inside. Let's go. We have slowed down in our pallet buying around here, but we still believe it's a great side hustle and we have a new secret side hustle that we've been using these pallet items for. So you may have heard us talk about our secret side hustle around here and we are finally ready to reveal it. What we do is we actually review these kinds of products that we get on these pallets put them on Amazon, and then we make a commission anytime someone watches them and buys that product. We've been doing this since April, and we have been making between four and $6,000 a month. And the best part is, is you guys can do it too. So we have created a crash course of sorts. We are going to go ahead and link that below and some more information. So if you wanna learn more about how to start that side hustle or even how to ramp up your pallet business side hustle and use it in another way, we highly recommend it. We think it's such an amazing side hustle to start. So check that out if you're interested. So let's get to opening these and see what we got today. All right. All right, let's go. I got a good Ooh. feeling. I think I know what this is and I'm gonna have, oh. Oh, I nope. thought I knew what it was. Oh, is it heavy? I thought it was a hat, because that's oh, what the box bummer. says. But... Oh, it's so heavy. Okay. Ooh. Fragile, it says. All right. So just because it says something on the outside of the box doesn't mean that's what's in it, especially with Amazon returns. So, oh. Oh, my. Anchor? Boat anchor? Something really heavy. Oh, yeah. Two boat anchors. So they are brand new, but... Not exactly boating season, if you know what I'm saying. Yeah. So. Well, not for us, right but for other people. We usually can sell these items for 50% of retail value. Mm -hmm. So we paid 325 for this pallet. So if we make 650, there you go. We broke even. So I'm pretty sure we'll, we'll break even. Yes. <gasps> Some Ooh, dishware. Oh yeah. Cute. Yep. 70 bucks. Show the camera. Pretty like bowls. Yeah, pretty like. Aww. A whole set. They're cute. That'll be probably a pretty good Facebook Marketplace sell for me. So that'll be perfect. And we get all our pallets from GRP Liquidations in Door, Michigan. This is called a stacked medium. And they're usually around 300 to 375. We got ours for 325 today. Oh, okay. We got some foam. foam. I don't want to take it out because I'll never get it back in. Some kind of mattress, mattress topper. topper. Gel infused firm support. Ooh, some frame. <laughs> Well, yeah, so, okay. Our nieces, for their graduation party, they had like 15 or 18 of these lined up in the driveway each year of their life. That's true. It's very, it's kind of graduate looking too with the gold and black. Yeah. There you go. Okay. Before we get any further into the video, we wanted to talk about the Anchor Solex F2000. Here in Michigan, fall usually means severe weather, and we actually mm -hmm. recently had a tornado go through nearby our house, and it knocked power out for about three days. Fortunately, we didn't have any damage to our house, but we did lose power, and we could have lost all of our groceries for that week. Fortunately, we had this. We plugged our basement fridge uh, into this battery, and it kept our food cold the entire time. Um, portable power stations like this are really handy to have on hand because um, there's lots of different scenarios where you might need it. We've used this for uh, working on our house outside where there's no plugs. We've used it in power outage situations or uh, you know tailgating with friends uh, before a football game. It's great to have something like this. The Anchor Solex F2000 is a 2048 watt hour battery that basically just means it's a really big battery and it can power a lot of stuff for a long time. So this thing has 12 power ports, including four AC ports and one 30 amp RV port, which is really great uh, for when we take this camping. Uh, we can plug the full 30 amp plug 
into our RV and then power the entire thing, including the air conditioning. So that's a pretty awesome feature. So because this battery is so powerful, it is quite heavy, but it has this nice easy tow handle and wheels so that you can wheel it around anywhere. It also has this nice flashlight feature so that when you have a power outage, you can still see. Unlike other power stations, this battery will charge to 80% in one hour, which is extremely fast. I was super impressed by that. Uh, you can also charge it with solar panels if you're in an off-grid type situation. And this battery is good for 3,000 charge cycles or 10 years of use, so it's designed to last a long time. Uh, they make these things extremely durable. They also have awesome Prime Day deals going on right now. So if you click that link below, you'll see that the Anchor Solix F2000 is $600 off, which is the lowest price ever. And there is also up to 50% off other Anchor Solix products. So definitely check that link out. Let's get back into the video. This is a light one. What's All right, that? little jerry can here. It looks like for RV oh. drinking water. Okay. Camping drinking water, so cool. All right. Unused. This guy down here is the one that I'm hoping pays for the whole pallet. Yep, that's why we picked the pallet. It's Electrolux, which is an expensive brand. But we have no idea if it's inside, if that's what's inside, or even really what it is. So, yep. but hopefully it pays for the whole pallet. This guy down here is the one that I'm hoping pays for the whole pallet. Yep, that's why we picked the pallet. It's Electrolux, which is an expensive brand. But we have no idea if it's inside, if that's what's inside, or even really what it is. So, yep. but hopefully it pays for the whole pallet. Bigger items for a medium. I feel like they're not even this yep. big. We have actually got this item before, if it is what I think it is. Some kind of grill. Yeah, like a charcoal grill. Yeah, yep. that is kind of portable, right? Yep. But yeah. this one is brand, brand new, new in bubble wrap. Perfect, so we're not even gonna take that one out. That's good we'll stuff, we'll show up. a picture, yep. Facebook Marketplace for sure. This one I looked up before, I think it... I think we had this on top of our Airstream actually. Yeah, it's like for a camper, it's called Max Air Mini. When I looked it up at uh, GRP, it was like a hundred bucks. Yeah, it's just like a, is that cover for your air conditioner? Yeah, it covers like your pop-up ceiling or like roof vents to keep rain out. Sometimes those get old and brittle, but we had one of those on our Airstream. So somewhere like this on Facebook Marketplace, I'll try to sell it in like a specialized group. There's like campers of West Michigan or Michigan man stuff I'm yeah. in that group, like things like that. That might be an eBay item too, if it's a more True. expensive. If it's like 80 to hundred dollars, it might be eBay. Yeah, if it's worth shipping and I can get closer to retail value, then I will ship it. Oh my. This is a broken uh, <laughs> refrigerator door, so. That's gonna go in the garbage pile. All right, where was the Electrolux? Oh no. Did we open it already? Yeah. Oh shoot. Oh sad. Oh no. Oh man. All right, so this is the box <sighs> that said Electrolux on it. Which, that's a brand that has like three to $600 type items like vacuums and stuff like that. But it was a a fridge. Piece of garbage. Oh, sad. Bummer. Yeah, that was this. That was the reason I bought this. <laughs> that's, uh, that's no good. Oh, my heart. Let's keep going. It's not over yet. Whoa. Oh. I don't know what that is. Kind of pillow. I don't know. All right, what do we got? Another gel. Gel foam mattress. Foam. Mellow. Mellow brand. But this is one is in plastic. In plastic, that's good. So that's better. So that one will probably expand if I take it out. So I'm gonna leave it in there, but it's all in plastic. You sold foam. those before, right? Yeah, yep. Yeah, those retail for about 100 usually. Amazon Basics, rolled up. Another? In there, brand new, yeah, this is Amazon Basics. Brand. I think, yeah, right? Oh, but it's brand new. Yeah, that's yeah, nice. Yep. Okay, this one's heavy, it's big. A piece of, oh. Ooh. Oh, don't is... let that one fall because that's glass and oh, it's yeah. like $180. I'm going to hand it to you then. All right. Got that one? Yep. So this is a sconce. Well, if it's what's actually in here, let's check first. Huh? Oh! It's not what's in there? Mattress topper? Pillow? Oh! Pillow insert. Bummer, man. <laughs> it's new. See, you should let me pick next time. I had some good feelings from some other ones. But. Oh man. I saw this one and I when I looked it up, it was like $180. I was like, oh, that's a good one. Just a pillow. <laughs> no. Three of three, it says. Oh. Shoot. 
Let's look it up. All right, so I just looked this up and I'm not gonna take it out because it's brand new in the box, but it is a Ottoman. Okay. For a $860 living room set. What was this? Knifey knife there. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Brand new. Yep. I think it's like a leather, a pleather. A black leather, yeah. Black yeah. Leather. So cool. Yeah. That's desirable. Yeah, for sure. Cool. Last decorative fruit bowl. Oh, that's it what it actually is. actually a... You pull that out, show them. Fancy blue glassware. Oh, wow, that's probably more expensive than I know, than that's probably real pricey. Crystal home collection. That doesn't mean crystal, probably, but... It might be, look at that. No, Fancy. stop. $48 for okay. a bowl, so... Christmas tree. Make sure that's what's in there. Oh mm -hmm. yeah, ooh. Oh, a pink, a pink one! <gasps> We're keeping sure. this for sure. Ruby would probably love that. Ruby will love it! Look at that. Pink. It even comes with like, pink oh, tree. it's perfect for her room. Ornaments. It comes with little ornaments. She's gonna love it. <laughs> All right. Look how cute it is. Yeah, this is something I would never go pay like $80 for, but I make my daughter very happy and I got it for, well, sort of free. All right, ooh, I think this is a, yup, I like these. This got? is a rocking chair, camp chair. These things sell really well for me on Marketplace. This is a giant tent, actually, here oh. too. Coleman, that's which nice. is a good brand. That's a bigger six-person tent, so that's cool. at least $100. I would think so, yeah. yeah. So, still not too late for camping. People fall camp camping. In the fall, yep, so. Could sell it as a set. It says backpack chair, so maybe another kind of camping yeah, chair. Yeah, or like a toddler back. Well, big toddler. <laughs> yeah, you're right. This is cool. I like this one. Oh, this is just like a beach chair, though. Yeah. I don't know why it's called a backpack chair. Oh, well, you oh, can yeah. wear it, it as a backpack. backpack. There you go. <laughs> That's why. What do you think? Ready to go to the beach? Let's go. <laughs> Sweet. Nice. Let's see what we got. Camera overheated, so we got a new camera here. Oh, what's that? I don't know. Ooh. That's kind of cool. Kind of fun. Some sort of like a weekender bag that's very cute. There's like a toiletry bag inside it. Too. Yeah. The set. Really nice. And in here, we got a big safe. Really? Is it locked? Before. Every safe we've ever gotten has been locked. Yeah. People lock them in and then they return it because they're like, yeah. what do I do with this? Right. Is there a key in there? <laughs> Opened? Come on. Hey. Oh, oh, it opens. It opens. Hey, it's pretty All right, cool. look it up, look it up. That looks like a, actually a pretty decent one. I don't know if you guys can see That's that. That's pretty nice. But uh, it's shiny. I like shiny stuff. <laughs> Looks like 159. All right. Sweet, and it's in good shape. That was a surprise. I wasn't feeling super great, Just. but now I do. Yeah, that was yeah. a helpful, a helpful one for sure. All right, last one. This Wind one is window probably frame. broken. <laughs> does seem broken. But let's just check, you never know. Oh, oh no, it's... Something broken. It's shattered. <laughs> oh. Okay, oh. watch it there. The rest of it looks like this. Yes, so. bunch of wood, broken yeah. wood in there. That's all right. How do you feel? I feel all right. That was an okay palette, but the best part about this is we can review the items and start generating passive income. So that's right. I think we'll definitely break even. I think we'll we've done calculations on our other some of our other videos, and it ends up being about twenty bucks an hour. So yeah, it's really a pretty good side hustle. So yep. twenty to forty bucks an hour, actually. at least. Yeah, so. just for reselling. Yeah. But then what we have been making our real money on is our other secret side hustle that we told you guys at the beginning of the video. We have links that below. Please go check it out. We really, really believe in it. We think it could change your life. Oops. All right. Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time. Bye. Bye. Thank you.